Hello, my name is Joy, and I'd like to read a book for you. It's all about being destructive. Why don't you follow along as I read? This book is about Lenny. Reading about Lenny can help you understand and deal with being destructive. You are being destructive when you break something, ruin something, or make a mess. What are you doing with my things? You are being destructive when you break something. If you break other people's things, try to fix them. If you cannot fix them yourself, ask for help. You broke this, now you have to fix it. <sighs> you are being destructive when you ruin something. If you ruin other people's things, try to replace them. I'm sorry, but this tape recorder is ruined. Mm -hmm. You are being destructive when you make a mess. If you make a mess, clean it up. You ruined my tape recorder and you made a mess of my room! Huh? Wanting to know what something is and how it works might cause you to be destructive. You might handle something to learn more about it. You might ruin it if you do not know how to handle it in the right way. Avoid being destructive. Do this instead. Talk to someone. Find out what things are and how they work before you handle them. I still don't know what makes this thing work. Having an accident might cause you to be destructive. Avoid being destructive. Do these things instead. Pay attention to what you are doing. Handle things carefully. Move cautiously when you are around things that can be broken easily. Oops! Not caring about something might cause you to be destructive. Avoid being destructive. Do these things instead. Try to understand that things around you are important. Try to take care of them. I don't care if this gets broken. It's not very important. Being angry or frustrated might cause you to be destructive. You might abuse things when you are angry or frustrated. Avoid being destructive. Do this instead. Calm down before you handle anything that could be broken or ruined. Avoid being destructive. Do this instead. Stay out of places you have been told to stay out of. There might be things in those places that could be broken or ruined. Please do not play in the living room. There are too many things in there that could get broken. Avoid being destructive. Do this instead. Do not touch things you are not supposed to touch. They might be things that could be broken or ruined. You may look at this, but please don't touch it. It might get broken. You might need to be punished if you disobey and are destructive. The punishment should help you learn that you must obey when you are asked to leave something alone. You disobeyed me and broke this. Now you will need to be punished. Mm -hmm. You might need to be punished if you are destructive because you do not care. The punishment should help you learn that you need to care about the things around you. You have not been careful. You have broken many of your toys. There will be no more toys until you learn to care about your things. You might need to be punished if you choose to be destructive. The punishment should help you learn that you should not be destructive on purpose. You did this, so you have to scrub it off. 
I'm taking your crayons away from you for one week. Being destructive hurts yourself and the people around you. That is why you should not be destructive.